I guess I'll take y'all on a brief little walk with me up to the bus stop for a minute. Otherwise, it's a pretty boring walk all by yourself. <laughs> My ex is such a smart ass. I call him to let him know that I'm leaving home for just a few minutes um, so that he can be on alert since, um, you know, we're pretty much in a neighborhood where everybody knows and has respect for us and doesn't, you know, mess with our things, but you never know. So it's better to be safe than sorry, of course. And so I call to let him know I'm not going to be there. And he goes, he tells me, well, neither am I. <laughs> it's like, okay, smart ass. So anyway, luckily I don't have to walk too far. It's like not even a block up. I've just got to go to this bus bench right up here. And then hopefully the bus will be along in the next five, ten minutes. Gosh, it sure is hot out here once you get out from under the shade tree. And then, of course, when the COPD starts kicking in, it makes it a little challenging to breathe at times. This is kind of what a, um, you know, day in the life of Angel is like. <laughs> Not very exciting, um, to say the least. I could definitely use a little bit more of excitement in my life. More excitement, less chaos. <laughs> some fun, some joy. Be nice to get out and attempt to do a little bit more than I do generally at this point. But when you lack a vehicle and with disabilities and illnesses that tend to hold you back at times, whether you allow them to or not, they're definitely challenging because say I wanted to, um, if I wanted to go down to the Bayfront, perfect example, I used to be able to walk that trip. I could tough it and then um, crawl down the seawall and make it into the water. Well, nowadays, if I attempt that, I'm lucky to make it down to the seawall <laughs> and back home. I can't get down the wall once I get there to enjoy the water. So that kind of takes the fun out of that trip. Um, I haven't tried it here lately because I know the past few times I did, I was really pushing my luck and it kind of sucked the joy right out of that. <laughs> um, you know, it took the fun right out of it, so to speak. So anyway, while I'm about at the bus stop, I just thought I'd entertain y'all for a minute for anybody else that was bored see what I get to go through on a daily basis when I do decide to venture. This is life. Anyway, y'all take care.